packed up now. It's been two weeks. Is it two weeks? Wednesday. Two weeks and a day since I got Jack. So we packed all the caravan stuff up, all the like dirty towels and things in the car, um, all the dirty washing, all the dogs are sleeping in the back. And we're heading back from Worthing to London. He's, uh, he's been persistent, but Daniel's not the most patient of people. But I think hopefully this will learn him purpose. Look at those guys there. See, we have six sexy rugby men in London and a sexiest spot. Alright, Jack, come up. Up. <laughs> so she knows, um, what? Sit. She got that really quick. Lay down. Lay down. She's getting that. Now she's getting up. up. But I did, I did say to Daniel that these um, weeks now, these between like 8 and 16, I might be wrong, but I just know that these early weeks are definitely definitely really important if you want to instill some long-term training and I'm into really your foot. No, he's not. He's just um, he's just not very patient, but he's getting it. He's getting it. Spin. Spin. No. Spin. Good girl. Spin. Spin. <laughs> Spin. Spin. Jack. Jack. Spin. 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 No, dead. No. Spin. Sit. Lay down. Good girl. Sit. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Good girl. Daniel took both my dogs out. Well, my dogs. Jack and Belle. And look how nice Daniel's been. He's made me... What is it? Scrambled eggs and avocado on toast. That's nice. I just popped into the hat hire shop where my friend Rosie works, as you can see. And underneath the table there, you can see little Olive. And Olive is not very happy that I bought Jack. She's been very funny. But Jack's been, well, there you go, you can hear her growling again. But Jack's been sleeping, what, like 15 minutes? and. Olive seems alright, but she's got a bone. What do you expect? Well, half past nine this morning, Jack, <laughs> Jack, come on. She decided to have like an incredible amount of energy jumping around everywhere. Alright, off to the park and hopefully they don't. Oh god, she's not gonna like this. Sorry, sorry, there you go. Come on, Jack. Oh, okay. One, two. Ooh. And how are you, Belle? Are you okay, Belle? Yeah. I didn't bring a ball for her. And this is what happens when you get an older dog who's really not bothered about the baby. He just keeps teasing the dog all the time. In fact, you can't see it. Yeah, and the normal state of affairs. <laughs> Daniel playing with Jack doing all the things you're not supposed to do to get it excited, but we both seem to be having fun. <laughs> Come on. Oh, oh, excuse me. Jack. Up, 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 up. <laughs> and squeaky bell, and jealous bell. <laughs> Just another day in paradise of which is Fulham in London, and me and the girls are walking to the park. God, I mean, Saturday, but there's still quite a lot of traffic. Here are the girls just there, right at the side of me. Oh. Give them a nice little run because my friend Sarah, she's gonna pop round and she's gonna spend a few hours on the computer. So I don't want the dogs jumping up and annoying her. Hopefully, they're gonna sleep. Okay, say goodnight, Jack. Say it again, Jack. Say goodnight. Thank <laughs> you.
So this is the other end of Bishop's Park and on Sundays, well I don't know if it's every Sunday, but just behind me you can see it's market and they have like bread and olives and um, uh, yeah, like farming festivals over there. They're a little bit more expensive but it's nice to see and walk around and have a look. There's some like nice preserves just there. God, I wish you brought the dog's leave, then I can have a look. It's okay. Look, some nice bread. Ooh, nice bread. Actually, this is really nice. But I'm a bit scared of the dogs going on and try and get some. Actually, these, no, those are on the lead as well. Some dogs over there, look. It's only polite, but me being so close to the park with the car, I thought, don't need the lead. There's so much to choose from. I wonder how much it is that. Beautiful coffee place. Gorgeous. Look at all those gorgeous fresh fruit veg you can get in the morning. And these people for a Sunday roast. And these people Perfect. only they're only gonna take cash, aren't they? They're not gonna take hard. Well we, we can, can get, always go and have a look. I don't think we get any cash or anything. Okay, let's have a look. Let's try and get a coffee or something. Yeah, what about the sister fun? I don't know if you know what I mean. I'm gonna be doing a bit of that later, but we'll talk about that another time. <laughs> I don't know what she's talking about. He does. <laughs> Good morning. It is oh Monday morning and Jaxi in my shoes. Daniel's got a few days off. He's got Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday off. So we decided we're going to go back to the caravan and um, oh, try some different areas there. Once we get settled down in the caravan, we'll probably just take a little walk around that area. Oh, there, Daniel, a bit naked. Oops. Daniel's just tied Jack up at the caravan and we're bringing up all the bags. Oh, there you go. Just can't get out, which is good because otherwise the owners will complain. And Daniel's just, what's he doing? What are you doing, Daniel? Oh, he's doing. Hmm. And I will go and get the rest of my cheap Aldi shopping. And some campsites you can leave the electricity plugged in on this one you can't. So every time you leave, you have to get rid of the water, you have to get rid of obviously the wastewater. Um, and put the electricity cable back so we have to keep taking food back with us and oh I don't know it's a bit of a pain really but it takes about what 10 minutes to set up but when it is it's nice and comfortable out of the way and we can relax and have a drink water for the dogs come on I gave her pig's ear and um, Belle had some little pig's hide and Belle also ate, and I don't, can't find it, so I presume she's eaten Jack, it. Jack, she's come had here. a um, um, buffalo come throat. Anyway, she enjoyed it. It's morning and I am making breakfast. We got this amazing, well, it's actually a walk. And it, oh God, it heats up so quickly. So I'm gonna make a nice breakfast for Daniel who's sleeping in the bed. He's not, wait, wait, I can say hello. Good morning, Daniel. No, but as soon as he starts smelling the food, he's gonna want some. I promise you. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have some mushrooms and I'm gonna have some beans as well. And I can all do it, I can do it all in one pan. And it's so cool because you can put the bacon around the edges and they could last. Um, and then, obviously, well, before that, you put the sausages in the black pudding, and then right at the end, you put the mushrooms. There's a finished breakfast, so we've got a full English breakfast there, full of everything. Just point out, Daniel's on the toilet, but he's miserable every morning trying to get him up. You don't want to get him. You hate the sound of your voice. And I do this for him. Yeah, you can make a sound. He's sat on the toilet having a poo, making faces at me. Don't care. We've come to South Downs, we parked in South Downs Way. We've got Daniel, Jack, and Belle, and we're going to go on an adventure. Well, put this way until it starts raining, then I'm going to come back. Oh, we're going down the wrong way. So we're going to have a head up there. We're going to follow the hikers because they seem to know what they're doing anyway. This is South Downs Way, by the way. This is the closest. Is it Washington we're in? Washington. Yeah. Washington Village. Oh, it's beautiful. I mean, I really don't know what's behind us, but it is lovely. And we just asked that lady there <laughs> what is correct, either or either or neither or neither or neither because i use what do i use either 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 i use either you use either either so that lady said apparently they're both correct i don't know what you use um yeah there's no Dirty cow has been eating cow poo. 
and she's picking it up and eating it and I don't think it's going to be good for her and plus she's going to be licking my face later so I've been a bit mean and we've been shouting at her but don't want her to get used to picking up shit that's the last thing Jack the cow food eater